What is up guys, it's DJ Martini Midwest Reviews coming at you with another video from my channel. Today I have a really cool little tech item, the NS7 from Sony. It is a neck wearable uh, speaker for your home theater or audio system. Um, so it works very, very good. I really wanted to bring it to you. I just did a video not too long ago on the NB10 from Sony, which is just a basic smaller model of this. Uh, in my opinion, it doesn't work as good and it has very, very smaller sound but we'll get into that as well so i did have to trade that nb and nb10 for this ns7 uh, to be able to get this item so i don't have that to compare it to you and show you guys but i can talk about it a little bit later so thank you guys so much for tuning in guys this is the ns7 from sony it's a neck wearable speaker and we're gonna get it to it really quick but first Thank you guys so much for tuning in to DJ Martini Midwest Reviews. If you guys like tutorial videos, review videos on various items, you know, valued items, expensive items, zingers every once in a while on uh, just items that I normally wouldn't do, but if I think they are a value to you guys, they work good, uh, those types of things, I definitely want to bring them to you. Also, if they're not good, I want to bring that to you as well. Uh, if I just try out an item, uh, I definitely want to bring you guys that information. That way you guys have an idea if you guys are looking for particular items out there that you just don't see on YouTube, maybe I can fill that uh, void for you guys for that information, guys. All I want to do is help. I uh, just like to help and uh, uh, give you guys ideas on these products. So hopefully I can get that done. And if you guys think my videos are helpful, give me a thumbs up, like, subscribe, and share. And that way I continue bringing videos to you guys. Thank you guys so much. Let's get into this NS7 here, guys, from Sony. Uh, I think it is a fantastic looking speaker. I enjoy it. Most of the time, I don't even notice that I have it on, uh, especially when you're sitting and you're watching television and things like I really like and enjoy the speaker. Now you're like, what would this speaker work for? Well, just like the NB10, uh, it definitely worked for office work. Uh, it does have an internal microphone and speakers, of course, on top that go straight into your ears, guys. Uh, so office work if you're sitting at the office and you want a portable little speaker now everybody in the office would be able to hear but if you're like at home um, you can turn this down to a level where it's not crazy uh, so you could use it you know at an office uh, at work but if you are working from home this thing is awesome guys if you are at an office type setting and you're working from home not only is this going to be loud enough so you can hear your customers, but it's going to be awesome to talk into the speaker as well. It has a fantastic microphone, and I will give you a mic check at the end of this video, guys, so stay tuned for that. At the end of the video, I will give you a little example of what the mic sounds like connected to my phone. Uh, but other than that, guys, it, it is, would be great for office work, um, it, any kind of professional job where you need a good microphone and good sounding speakers, especially if you're working from home, though. Uh, that way it's a little bit more private and because this, this thing can get loud so you would have your whole office staff hearing you if you guys were listening to music or things like that so but other than that it is excellent for home theater use guys if you want to hook it up to your television and listen to TV or movies or things like that fantastic guys the the spatial audio the Dolby Atmos and things like that work great guys you really get a fantastic 360 hearing of like things going on gunshots whatever you're hearing in your movies it's just going to be a really cool experience and i can't even explain it you just kind of have to experience experience for yourself to get the full uh, uh full 360 um, sound experience guys also gaming is really awesome uh, we'll talk about that there's a couple of little hiccups in that but gaming is really good as well for listening to you know everything that's going around you footsteps gunshots things where they're coming from great experience to add some extra volume especially when you're in a loud environment uh, loud environment at home with your family or whatever's going on your kids uh, this can definitely add that extra sound to you and that's kind of what i got it for in the first place the nb10 i wanted to try it out see how if it could add some extra volume to my television since it's sitting right on you and that's exactly what it did. And I did like the NB10, but it just didn't satisfy my uh, passion for music because music just sounded very, very small on it. Uh, I couldn't get enough volume. Um, it just didn't, music didn't sound good to me, in my opinion. It's good enough, but it just didn't sound the way I wanted music to sound. And it sounded very, very small, very, very light. Um, I really think that one is particularly the NB10 is made more for office work, 
uh, talking on that microphone, phone calls, things like that, and just basic listening to your television. So if you wanted something uh, so you can listen to basic uh, television, uh, movies, things like that, it's not going to give you that super home theater feel, but you'll definitely be able to get extra volume. Uh, but when I listen to music, it just really disappointed me, and I did not get disappointed from this. Uh, so I'm glad I made the upgrade and picked up the NS7 compared to the NB10. Uh, like I said, I don't have anything against the NB10. It's just it didn't quite sound good enough for me for music-wise. Uh, music just sounded super small, and I couldn't get the volume and the feel that I think music should sound when you're listening to it on any speaker or headphone or thing like that. So let's look at the item here, guys. We will kind of look at this is your charge port right here. It is USB type C right there. Very easy to put in. Good construction on this, guys. It does have two passive radiators in these little compartments right here. So you're not going to get uh, like boomy feel on your neck or anything like that, but you will kind of feel the beat of the music, which is kind of cool. Um, nice little material right here, your Sony uh, logo right there. Pretty basic controls like this is gonna be your phone controller right here and then positive negatives for volume over here you have your mic control so you here's your microphone right here but you have on and off on the mic and then you also have your power button and also be your Bluetooth button so if you initially when you turn on the device if you press and hold you will start the pairing mode for your Bluetooth these do have internal Bluetooth so if your television has Bluetooth your laptop your tablet whatever you're using you can just connect straight to these with bluetooth very very easy it'll say ns7 connect boom uh, bluetooth connected so very very nice very very speedy connection this also does work with the sony app that way you can kind of adjust some of the settings the eq uh, set it up to the way you want it to sound uh, very very cool there as well so a lot of features and a lot of playing around you can do with this the sound is fantastic i will give you a little uh, sound check of these it's not going to sound very good because my microphone is down here and of course this sits on your neck but you will be able to hear what's going on and kind of get an idea of the sound the sound is very full very rich um, just super clear not super bassy but all the tones and everything from the low end are very, very clear, very precise, um, not muddy at all. Just everything's very, very clean sounding and um, it, it's a really good sound, uh, just not super bassy. So if you're looking for something super bassy, you're not going to get that from these, but it just sounds super clear, punchy and precise. So uh, what's in the box real quick? You'll of course get instructions, guys. Uh, big instruction booklet here. You'll get a charge cable over here. Uh, it is USB type C. It's a very small cable, about five, six inches. Uh, you do get a free trial of their 360 uh, reality audio music service. So that is a cool little feature that you can look into. You will get the Bluetooth puck as well. So if your TV does not have Bluetooth, you can make it have Bluetooth with this puck okay guys and this is particularly made for the sony device but it does come with this bluetooth puck and it will include the uh, digital audio cable right here guys which is an optical audio cable sorry an op audio uh, optical audio cable and the power cord of course right here this could plug straight into your tv or you can buy a little separate plug and plug it right into the wall guys but it will not come with that so you'll have to get that separate but it does come with this so basically if your tv does not have bluetooth you can use this and it'll work with the ns7 now if your tv already has bluetooth in the settings go to you know the audio outputs and if it's if your tv has bluetooth you can automatically pair to that ns7 and you will not really need this uh, but they kind of recommend this for some of their home theater. Uh, so if you need to plug this into to a uh, home theater receiver, that will also work to give your NS7 Bluetooth as well. So you will get that. You'll get some instructions right here on the box. And another thing that I just quickly will recommend, because a lot of TVs do not have extra... Uh, optical outputs they usually only have one so I would recommend buying a, uh, a splitter uh, so you 
basically hook this into your one optical cable from your TV and then it'll split it out three ways. So then this would hook into your little puck there and then you have an extra one for your uh, Blu-ray Blu player, your game system, whatever, uh, gives you some extra optical outs. So just an idea here, this is, I'll leave a link for this, this is the off-brand, uh, but definitely a cool device that works very, very well. I picked it up really inexpensive, about $10, and you'll be able to have a splitter for your optical outs to have a couple extra on the back of your TV. Now this will need some power as well, uh, so you'll have to hook that into a USB, or like I said, plug it into the wall as well so all right but i will leave a link for that as well guys uh, i think it's just a good idea to have an extra optical out uh, since usually most tvs only have one and you don't want to tie it up with just the ns7 other than that guys uh we'll get into a couple of the features for the ns7 this is ipx rated 4 so you can get it splashed wet um, it does have 12 hours of charging uh 12 hours of use time and then quick charging as well which means you can charge it for 10 minutes and you will get 60 minutes of play time which is pretty cool if you forget to charge this um, and it will work very 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 well for you guys like i said the operation is simple everything is simple basically bluetooth connect and go guys it's really really easy to simple uh, it does have that button on the side that's for your calling needs answer a call, hang up a call, that type of thing, your volume. Your microphone works very, very good. Like I said, I will give a quick microphone check at the end of this video as well to uh, so you can get an idea of the microphone. These are currently on right now. Uh, so I will put them on and I'll give you that audio check as well. We will go right here and I'll turn up the volume a little bit. It's a little bit lower right now, but I'll turn it up. So let's get that going low volume, I'll turn it up. This is full volume, full volume. Now this is probably the volume I would use it at if I was just casually listening to music. It doesn't sound that loud, um, probably because the microphone is lower than the speakers right now, but when it's right next to your ears, guys. <laughs> so when it's right next to your ears, guys, it, it, it does seem a lot louder. Uh, so you don't really need a lot of volume when it's pretty, pretty much right there next to your ears. So I really do like this device, guys. One of my favorite tech piece of techs that have come out lately is this a neck band wearable home theater speaker, guys. Um, it works great for home theater. Movie listening is just awesome. The way that they, they uh, position the speakers and that it feels like you're surrounded by the sound, it's really, really cool, guys. Um, other than that, guys, I think that's all I have for you. This has been the NS7 from Sony, guys. I will leave links for all these products if you guys are interested to check those out. Um, like I said, NS7s. Uh, I do have a video out there on the NV10s if you want to take a look at that. Like I said, uh, great neckband speaker as well, but just didn't cover music as well as these do, so I really do prefer these over the NV10s when you're listening to any music. Other than that, guys, if you guys have any other questions or comments, let me know. Hopefully this was useful on the NB10s to give you a little information. Other than that, like I said, they're really positives, guys. They're really easy to use. I mean, simple operation, guys. You basically connect and play and use, guys. Um, the um, Bluetooth works really, really good. Connects fast, easy. Phone calls sound good. I will leave a microphone test on these at the end guys uh, my only negative guys is the way they work for gaming now i'll put this out real quick they will not connect to your game system even if your game system has bluetooth they will not connect to your game system because 
I wish they would put a patch out for that maybe, but they will not connect, I'm gonna say it one more time, to your game system. You cannot use the microphone in these. You cannot, they will not connect. I, I tried PS4, PS5, uh, I tried the game systems. They will not connect to your game system. You have to use these through your TV. So they will, you can use them for gaming, but they have to go through your, your TV. So your TV will, your system's connected to your TV, the TV out audio is going to these, and then that'll work. Then you'll be able to hear everything going on in your game. Unfortunately, you will not be able to use game chat or any kind of chat audio will not come through these, or you can't use the mic as well. So none of that works through these. Hopefully they can put some kind of patch out to fix that. But you will be able to listen to audio from your game through your TV, but you cannot connect these directly to your game system. They're just not working at the moment, okay? So that's my only negative on the gaming part. You can listen to the audio from the game. You just can't use any of the chat features through the microphone or anything like that. So just to let you know, that's the only way you can use them for the gaming is through your TV first and not through your actual game system. All right, guys. So hopefully that knowledge is useful. Um, like I said, but they are quite excellent for everything else. They do hook up to your headphone connects through Sony, so you can kind of dial them in however you like to listen to your music and things like that, which is fantastic. They work uh, Bluetoothing to your phone or your tablet or laptops and things like that as well. So they are very, very handy and helpful, and I like to use them a lot. And I just wanted to bring them to you guys. I think they're really really cool speaker they are a little pricey at two hundred dollars but i think that's kind of totally worth it for the way they sound and the way they work with the home theater they also make an older tv that has the uh the audio the optical audio out they will make that tv bluetooth with that puck that they provide with you um, so you can make your kind of older tvs have that bluetooth and they will work with this device so that's kind of cool or if your tv is newer and it has bluetooth you can connect straight to it as well so all right guys what is up it's dj martini midwest coming with you with the microphone test for the ns7s this is the quality that you're going to get when you're talking into the microphone in the ns7s guys i just wanted to show you guys that everything works and that it sounds pretty decent uh, i do like the sound from the ns7s microphone so this is the sound you will get thank you for checking it out Thank you guys for, so much for tuning in. It's been DJ Martini Midwest. Hopefully if this was a helpful video, give me a thumbs up, like, subscribe, and share, and more videos to come on DJ Martini Midwest Reviews, guys. And we'll check you later.